trucker's worst nightmares to get on with a company that you think is great for five whole seconds till you find out everything's a lie. TNT Express LLC out of Illinois, it's your turn, honey. What's up, YouTube? Welcome back to Breaking Truckers. What country you from? What? What? what ain't no country I ever heard of. They speak English in what? What? English! Do you speak it? Yes. Then you know what I'm saying. Yes. The roommate still haven't seen a paycheck from this Illinois company. Shout out to Rosie Hex. That's a new name. I knew her. She went by the name of the Curvy Trucker. Check out her interview. It's it's in the it's in the archive somewhere. She's here to talk about another black ops company that has treated her friend driver real bad. TNT Express LLC. No more wasting time. Let's get it. Hold on. Every trucker's worst nightmare is to get on with a company that you think is great for five whole seconds till you find out everything's a lie. TNT Express LLC out of Illinois, it's your turn, honey. Now, my roommate actually runs for these fools. Ran for him for two weeks, still hasn't seen a paycheck. Running perfectly legal paper logs, only putting in some 20 hour days in a truck that has no AC, no headlights or speedometer. And when he told the company about this, they ignored it. You ever driven a truck in 100 degrees through Texas? Honey, you're gonna cook your balls. Now the fuel card ain't working and you gotta call them to beg for money just to fuel up your truck. And then the mechanics are calling you because the company hasn't paid their bills? I'm sick of these bad companies, y'all. Let's start calling them out. Well, there you have it, drivers. What do you think? What do you think? Have you heard of a TNT Express LLC out of Illinois? Another black ops company that I haven't even heard of. Of course, you know, from the information that she says about her friend and what her friend is experiencing with these companies. Yeah, yeah. If you're still running with a black ops company for more than two weeks and you haven't gotten paid yet, what are you doing what are you doing why are you still giving these companies a chance there shouldn't be a chance bro none at all if i didn't get paid the first week and you give me a, a subtle excuse and then the next following week comes around and you didn't pay me again and you give me the same BS excuse, then it's time to take the truck back and look for something else. It is not worth it. It is not worth you driving for these companies and you getting effed at the same time. They getting paid, you dropping the load, you picking up the load, you're delivering the load, you have the paperwork, you send in the paperwork, they get the paperwork and they send it in to whoever whoever pays them i guarantee you they get paid so if you getting paid from the companies that you brokering from then why are you not paying the drivers that delivered it think about it think about it we are the backbone of your company but yet you're pulling that backbone out i don't understand why put your foot on our necks we out there putting our necks on the line for you only for you to give us a messed up truck and some bs excuse about why we're not getting paid i get i i you know if you give me a truck that works that runs that's a do what it's supposed to do then i can do my job and get it to where it needs to be but if you're not paying me like you're supposed to and if the truck is a piece of s then bro why are you giving that company more time than a little bit it's time to move on, driver. 
it's time to move on you can't be sitting there making TikToks about, oh, well, this company is not treating me well, and, and I don't understand. I don't know what I'm going to do, and this company is a piece of ass and all like that. Yeah, 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 yeah. But you still with the company, though. So what's that say about you? Well, you know, I'm going to go in and, 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 and try to keep the, give them the benefit of the doubt. No. No, the benefit the benefit of the doubt was after the second week you didn't get paid. Now you out there with no money. And then she said something about you begging them for money. You don't beg a company for money. The, mu the, the company owes you. When do you need to beg a company for money? I don't get it. I don't understand it. I'm trying to... I'm, I'm, I'm trying. I'm trying to understand. I'm trying to understand why you drivers out there giving these black ops companies too much of your time. Your time is valuable. Remember that your time is valuable, man. So drivers, if you driven or drive for TNT, let me know your experience because we only hearing this from this young lady right here. She don't drive for tnt uh llc she says her friend does but i i wouldn't put it past what she says is true okay but if anybody does drive for that company tnt express out of illinois let us know in the comments below and let us know your experience always always you know where to come right here on the recruiter call channel my channel is always here for you you can always get with us and let us know how your experience with either a black ops company a major company or a mom and pops company we're here we love to listen and we love to share your testimony on the recruiter call channel Big got it locked, boy.